and welcome. My name is Jean Herto. I'm a gynecologic oncologist and current U.S. Senior Medical Director for Gynecological Malignancies at GSK. Today, I will explore a crucial aspect of oncology education. The early identification of immune-related adverse events, or IRAEs, for patients undergoing immunotherapy treatment for endometrial cancer. Immunotherapy harnesses the body's immune system to help fight cancers. Potential treatment benefits and risk for this class of agents should be carefully factored into the clinical decision-making process. Risks can include an immune response against healthy tissues causing IRAEs. The most common IRAEs occur in the liver, endocrine system, GI system, and the skin. These IRAEs can have variable time to onset. Therefore, physicians need to be vigilant in recognizing laboratory abnormalities and early signs of all potential IRAEs. IRAEs can be severe and fatal and can occur in any organ system or tissue. They can happen during treatment and even after treatment discontinuation. Why is early identification of IRA so critical? Early identification can prevent the development of severe complications that could affect patient outcomes. Educating physicians and patients about early signs and symptoms of IRAs allows the physician to act swiftly and decisively. Several expert guidelines exist to guide management of IRAs. Providers should reference the prescribing information for any medication they prescribe. By anticipating and recognizing IRAs early, physicians can strategize and implement interventions that may improve patient outcomes. Learning to navigate the complexities of IRAs can help ensure that patients receive the best possible care. For patients and physicians, continuous education, clear communication, early identification, and intervention are the keys to managing IRAEs. The landscape of medicine is forever evolving, and so must be the knowledge of those at the forefront. Collaboration among healthcare professionals is paramount. Physicians, nurses, pharmacists, and all team members need to be well-versed in recognizing and addressing IRAEs. In conclusion, the importance of educating both providers and patients regarding early signs and symptoms of IRAEs cannot be overstated, as it may help tip the scales in favor of positive patient outcomes and well-being. Thank you. Thank you.